God's word is simply a mirror of our life. When we want to know where we are going, we need to run to the mirror of life. And what is the mirror of life? God's word. Am I talking to you? What is the mirror of your life? God's word. What you are going through is not new. What you are yet to go through is you will still find it in that book. But look at our confession today. When we are sick, when we are in pain, when there's no bread on the table, look at your confession today. Satan wants you to doubt God. Satan wants you to curse God. That's why it takes Faith. For one to say you are my provider, even when there's no food to eat, you are my protector, even when you are in trouble, it takes faith. For one to say thank you, Jesus, when he's going through pain. A man of faith. Will always pay attention to what God has to say. Regardless of what he's going through, he will run to the secret place. God, what are you saying? In the midst of pain, God, what are you saying? Because a man of faith believes and trusts in God's ability. So if you are a man of faith, you will not confess the sickness. You will not confess failure. You will not confess disappointment. But you will always confess victory. Because you know that joy comes in the morning. I say joy comes in the morning. And every night has a morning. And whatever has a beginning it has an end. Your pain has a beginning and it has an end. That situation that you are going through now has a beginning and it has the end. Tell your neighbor, say neighbor, keep calm. Keep calm. Your situation has a beginning and it has an end. Are you a man of faith? If you are a man of faith, woman of faith, you will not allow your situation to direct your steps. 